Seagrass is a flowering plant with incredible adaptations that mean it can complete its whole life cycle under the sea. It grows in sheltered shallow waters around our coast, rooting into the sand and reaching up to the light with its long green blades. Seagrass meadows are an increasingly rare and important habitat in our shallow seas, supporting diverse marine life like juvenile fish, eyelash worms and pipefish. In Cornwall, we know that much of the seagrass we once had has been lost. This is due to a combination of pressures, including disease, coastal development and marine pollution. In Lou Voluntary Marine Conservation Area, a team of local volunteers decided to find out more about the seagrass bed just off their main beach. Cornwall Wildlife Trust organised a special survey to find out how far the bed extended with help from Plymouth University who lent the team a remotely operated vehicle or ROV and a specially trained pilot to fly it underwater. The team deployed the ROV along a series of transects where they thought the seagrass might be. Straight away, they could see the tall, healthy seagrass blades swaying in the current. They searched for the edges of the meadow, which petered out as the water became deeper and were delighted to find that the bed extended across a huge area to the east of Loo, all the way to the next bay at Millandreth. A map of the seagrass bed was created to show people where this delicate and precious habitat lies. There is still more to be mapped and the team hopes that they may have discovered what locals had long suspected, that Lou Voluntary Marine Conservation Area supports the largest seagrass bed in Cornwall.